This is a Stephen Cargos, and it's arguably the best cargo pants model ever created. And it's what started it all for me. But what happens after you have Stephen Cargos? The next step would be to start building your wardrobe. And finding a place to start can be really hard, so this is a guide for somebody who wants to take their style to the next level and start building their wardrobe. Let's get into it. I like to start styling in a non-traditional manner, bottom to top. And shoes are either the first or last article of clothing anyone will look at. So it's either going to make a good first impression or it's going to make a lasting finishing impression. Here are some classic techwear shoes that are in my wardrobe that are also bound to work in any other techhead's wardrobe. The Nike X Matthew & Williams free TR3 features a removable outer sole, while shoes like 11 by Boris the Johnson Berry Salomon features Gore-Tex water repellency. This is another shoe I have called the Y3 Casa High and rather than focusing too much on function, this one's much more of a form shoe. It doesn't have an amazing ability like Gore-Tex or a removable sole, but what it does have is that classic staple techwear sneaker look. A common styling pattern that is usually found in techwear sneakers is a mid or high rise shoe, a tapered ankle, and a robust aggressive design. Because of the tapered ankle, techwear shoes can be hard to style with regular pants, and regular pants is not what you want to style with techwear. The Stephen Cargos are possibly the most popular pants I've ever featured on my channel and that is because it's affordable and it has a multitude of features. With 3M Scotchgard water repellency, 3 spacious cargo pockets, and even removable strapping, the Stephen Cargos are the essential techwear bottoms. If your budget is a bit bigger and you want to go with something that has a bit more heft to it, the Atheist Rapid Deploy Pants V2 is going to be the perfect choice for you. It has fidlock magnetic buckles on the sides to secure your goods and to protect you from the cold, it's going to have an inner storm placket that's padded to protect you. Last but not least, a great pair of pants to have in your wardrobe, especially with the upcoming summertime, is the Two Pockets Modified 020 Pants by Riot Division. These cargo pants bring lightweight cargo pants to the next level with perforated gussets for ventilation and a four-way stretch nylon fabrication so it's going to be extremely comfortable and it's going to flex to wherever you need to get to. You can bend down and not worry about any seams popping at all. Now that we have the shoes and bottoms, the tops are where the techwear aesthetic really starts to fall into place. The techwear style is highly inspired by a cyberpunk future, a future where privacy is non-existent from the government and corporations. Masks provide a sense of privacy and security from Big Brother. One of my favorite pieces is a 057 high neck long sleeve. It has all three things I consider to be the holy trinity, affordability, functionality, and style. With this turtleneck, you can wear it as a traditional turtleneck or you can pull it up to wear it as a mask. The mask actually has a small cut at the front of the turtleneck to enhance breathability as well as sleeves that go across your hand so that you have a little thumb hole and you could keep your hands warm and protected. It's also a really awesome layering technique when it comes to jackets, but we'll talk about that in the next step. You can start pushing techwear into a more avant-garde style with Hamkus's Dune Raider bodysuit. Now this bodysuit can be worn the same way as Rain the Illusion's 057 high neck long sleeve, where you can pull it up into a mask, wear it as a turtleneck, but the difference between this one, it's a full bodysuit. So you can pull it all the way across your face like a ski mask. The fabrication of this bodysuit is absolutely amazing using garment dye technology to bring this beautiful jade color out of this bodysuit. And to add something a bit more casual to the outfit, this is the Baggage Scanner Long Sleeve Tee by 51%. It depicts a baggage going through an x-ray with an AK-47 inside. And I thought that was a very unique and creative print to have on the back of a t-shirt. Now let's get into outerwear. A good techwear outfit will always consist of a good techwear jacket to finish the outfit. This is the latest jacket release from Riot Division and it's called the Nullis Jacket. With ventilations throughout and a hidden poncho mode, this jacket is perfect for humid and rainy conditions. Pair it with the two pocket modified pants for a futuristic look or you could style it with the Steven Cargos for a fully water repellent style. And like I talked about before, you can play with the layering by combining the 057 high neck long sleeve 
with the Nolis jacket to add the sleeve details of the 057 Southerly Show. The 066 jacket is a truly multifunctional jacket from easy carry straps to an external outer shell. You can remove the outer shell by releasing the red fitlock hook which pops the jacket open which will have snaps to secure it even more in place. Once you remove that, you will have a regular rain parka jacket underneath. If conditions get too humid and the rain stops, you can also take off the jacket and carry the jacket using the easy carry strap, which I found extremely useful. And finally, let's talk outfit finishings, accessories. An accessory is like a buff to a car watch, the finishing piece to make your whole outfit shine. The M100 is a perfect gear to carry your personal electronics and maximize your storage with additional mods. The mole webbing on top of the M100 allows for extreme customization with various mods which you can customize and change and adapt to your environment. Or for a more luxurious look, substitute for a leather panel crossbody bag by 51%. I love the angled and aggressive cuts of this bag and this just adds that extra pop. And finally, this is one of my everyday daily carries which is the A403 which I actually have on right now. It features a fitlock slider mechanism that is perfect to secure your keys and daily accessories. And the keychain is just a really interesting and really cool mechanism. Sometimes accessories just add that extra robust pop to your outfit. And I think the AC403 just really adds that. Especially when it's hot, you just wear a t-shirt, the Steven Cargos, and the AC403 with this Elite Spell, the outfit for me just really comes together. When I first started Techwear, I found the best way to mix and match your wardrobe is three bottoms, three tops, two outerwear pieces, and three accessories. And that allows for you to rotate your pieces without getting too bored. And if you guys know me, I leave a code at the end of the video if you guys stay till the end. So you guys can use the code HOON at checkout to get 10% off any of the items I talked about today. I want to wish you luck on your techwear journey and the development of your style and I'll see you guys next week.